Compressed gases like that from this can of electronics duster show up great using Schlieren imaging. And I already showed what it looks like to refill a lighter with butane. But let's look at some other cool examples with compressed or heated air. Here's what a heat gun looks like on the low setting, and if I switch it to the high setting, you see the force convection moving even faster. Next, one of my favorites, which is releasing compressed air from a blower gun. I've got a few different nozzles to try out, and just for reference, the air will be coming out at around 90 psi. With the first nozzle, you see some beautiful shock diamonds. Shock diamonds are standing shock waves and are perhaps most famously found on supersonic jets. Although those obviously look much cooler, this is much simpler and is still awesome. I also tried it out with an inflation needle like you'd use to pump up a ball, and I was surprised to learn these haven't gone up in price that much over the years. Anyway, this smaller nozzle still produces some standing shock waves, but it's definitely harder to see. I used the last attachment which had a medium sized nozzle relative to the two others, and this was pretty solid too. Twisting an empty but wet water bottle to a high pressure and then releasing it creates some fog. And here's what that looks like. The abrupt drop in pressure drops the temperature which creates condensation. I tested a lot more including some pretty random items and you can see those in the full video.